Jesus said, I ain't come for peace. I came with a sword. A lot of people have this watered down, hippie, kumbaya idea of Christianity, but he says, I've come to set mother against daughter, father against son. When you speak truth, here's the reality. It's always gonna cause division. You're gonna have people who hate it. You're gonna have people who love it. You're gonna have people who reject it. You're gonna have people who accept it. You're gonna have people who embrace it. You're gonna have people who try to silence it. What side of truth will you be standing on? Now, here's the thing. Some of you, you feel like because you're standing on the right side with your pastor and you're in the right standing with your church, you're on the right side with God. But the truth is that you can be right with your pastor, you can be right with your church and still be wrong with God. And so here's the reality. This is how Jesus is coming. He's going to divide, right, the wheat from the tares. And in the end, it's either going to be, well done, my good and faithful servant, or depart from me, I never knew you. What side are you going to be on, right? Here's the reality. A lot of people are trying to hide right here in the middle and not pick a side. He says, because you are neither hot nor cold, I will spit you out my mouth. This is what I want to tell you, and I'm going to keep this short. You better make sure that you're on the right side of truth. A lot of people are saying, you know what? Well, well, I'm not going to speak the truth because I'm going to get canceled. I'm, I want to stand on this side because, you know what? I don't want the persecution from stepping on the other side. All that matters is what God thinks. That's all that matters. Either it's going to be, well done, my good and faithful servant, or depart from me, I never knew you. They're going to say, well, we did this in your name. We did that in your name. He's going to say, depart from me. I never knew you. You were on the right side of truth. Now, here's the thing. Some of you, you've been feeling discouraged. You've been feeling afraid. Remember what you carry. Some of you are in the middle of a battle right now, but you forgot what you carry. You're sitting there in front of Goliath and you're intimidated, you're afraid because you forgot what you carry. The Lord wanted me to remind you, remember what you carry. Remember who you are. Remember what I put inside of you. Remember the word, remember the praise, remember the worship. Yes, yes, you're on the battlefield, but you're equipped. You're equipped. Remember the last video that we just talked about. You're equipped for war. Remember what you carry and have that mindset. As for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. And that's the bottom line. As for me and my house, no matter what everybody else is doing, we will serve the Lord. As for me and my house, if nobody else stands, we'll stand. If nobody else prays, we'll praise. As for me and my house, I want to be on the right side of truth. Y'all be blessed, be encouraged in Jesus' name.